happy Sunday, y'all. I do not know why today I'm literally so drained, but I feel like I'm so tired and I literally still have one working day before it is my day off and I get to like kind of unwind and I still feel like I'm not going to be able to unwind like that because I have this thing that I have to pick up in the city. Tomorrow I have my first sociology class from 7 p.m. to 10 p.m. So I'm definitely going to have to go home tomorrow evening and like sleep for a little bit because if I don't sleep, I'm going to be falling asleep in that class and that is not it. So I need to figure that out. But um, I literally feel like I'm so drained and I was planning to go home and sleep, but that does not seem like it's going to be happening because it's 3.56 right now and it's going to take me like another 40 minutes to get home and like I'm going to have to find something to eat. So like the sleeping for today is looking a little bit slow, but um, yeah, I feel really, really tired. And this morning too, I didn't even take the espresso shot with the coffee because I'm trying to not drink the espresso shot every single day if I don't have to. So I didn't even take that and I felt like I slept pretty just okay last night, you know? But gosh, I really would love to go home and just lay down in my bed right now. And it's not even that today was a rough day because today wasn't bad at all. So I'd, I'm not even sure like why I feel so drained. Maybe it's just a combination of like working all these days behind each other. But I feel beat, literally. And I was off two days ago. I don't understand it at all. There really is no explanation for none of this. I don't have anything planned for this evening other than to go home and like chill. I'm thinking maybe I could go home and like cook something probably. I don't know. Because I don't even know. The other day I bought some pork and I put it in the fridge. I seasoned it and put it in the fridge. So maybe I could make like some of the pork loin or so. What I make that with though? Maybe some potatoes. I don't know. I don't really have to go home and see. But anything that I'm going to make I want it to be quick too. Because I'm, I'm not really in the mood to be in the kitchen for so long. And in this goddamn summertime it should be mad hot. Like damn. I did it again and I'm not proud. I'm not proud at all. They said the first step is <laughs> realizing that you're the problem. I'm at the Chinese spot buying shrimp and broccoli and pork fry. I feel like it's this car. I honestly feel like it's this vehicle. I feel like every time I'm in here, I'm buying food. I think that this car really is the root of all problems because every time I'm in here, I'm eating out and typically I cook at home. I look like a freaking toenail right now because today was such a rough day my head kind of hurts a little bit i'm off tomorrow but i have this class today and i wanted to go home so that i could sleep to have enough energy to join my class today but right now it's 4 13 so i still have like a lot of time where i'd be able to like sleep for like an hour an hour and a half because my class doesn't, doesn't start until 7 p.m so i have like a little bit of time where i could probably sleep for an hour and a, or an hour and a half and still be good I just need to wrap this up. Just left work and I'm literally at the Chinese shop again. But you know what? Whatever. I work hard and like whatever. <laughs> this is me justifying why I'm at this Chinese restaurant. Oh. However, I'm gonna... Um, I'm trying to make sure that I get my laundry done today because I'm literally running off of the last few pairs of scrubs that I own. Not really. I'm being traumatic. But kind of. So I need to go to the laundromat and I need to, um, that's pretty much it for the errands. I don't have to go to the laundromat today. I could really do that tomorrow. A man was parked here for 45 seconds and they gave him a ticket. And the aunt is walking around looking for the ticket guy. Like what the hell is going on? Anyways, yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm buying Chinese food. I'm sitting here thinking about it and I'm honestly not in the mood to go do any laundry today. Really, truly, honestly. But then again, we have this appointment too that I don't even know if we're going to go to because Mans has not confirmed it yet. And not only that, like I don't want to start the laundry and then have to leave to go to the appointment because then my, my clothes are going to either be in the washer or the dryer for an extended period and then somebody might take it out and it's too much of a process. I don't think I want to do that. So maybe I'll leave the laundry for a different day, honestly. I don't know what I managed to do just now, but... Um... I just got home. I feel like I'm so tired. I literally cannot even think. So, I'm going to end my workout first. I bought this gift bag just now at the Dollar Tree. Because I'm going to this baby shower over the weekend. Today's Friday. I think it's Sunday. Wow, it's so close. It's a good thing my hair is already in like a high bun. 
or like a semi cute bun because that's literally the day after tomorrow and I'm, I'm just, I'm so discombobulated. Like I'm only just realizing that. Hello? Hi. Okay. You want to pick up the laundry? Sure, not over it yet. I mean, yeah, it's, yeah, let's see that. I feel like I'm so tired, like I'm kind of all over the place here. I'm tired. I for the printer. Come home from work hours ago. Drop off my laundry bay laundromat to have them um, wash it. Went on the road. Where did we even go? Can't even remember where we went. And I got like a few deliveries. This is like some super nail glue that the Chinese people use. Oh my gosh, these are so small. These are supposed to be camera covers because last week in my sociology class, I took my shirt off. I was wearing sports bra. And I'm almost sure that the professor, instructor, whatever, could, <laughs> could see me. Because, like, when I took it off, I saw him, like, I don't know, but I was wearing sports bra, so it was whatever. So I bought these camera covers to cover the camera on my Mac. And then... This box, I'm not even sure what's in there and I don't feel like checking my orders right now. I'm also going to cut it with this candle wick trimmer. It's not working. This nightstand, I really need to do some. I use these things. Using this. You guys, I'm literally so excited about this. I'm running to the kitchen ASAP. This, I bought this. Oh, this is, the size is perfect. I bought this to put condensed milk in. Oh, why is it so wobbly? I mean, it is what it is. So I bought this to put condensed milk in. Maybe not, so maybe I'm gonna have to take the top off all the time, which literally defeats the entire purpose of buying a bottle like this, but I absolutely love it. And it's better than the one that I had, because now you're able to just pour it out. Shit is gonna take forever. That's all I bought. <laughs> Somebody thought it was funny. <laughs> Somebody some thought this laundry bag was funny. Is it not so cute? It literally says, I'd rather be sleeping. <laughs> I'd rather be sleeping than doing laundry. And a sloth is on there. And I feel like sloths are the literal laziest, or they just literally love to sleep. So that was funny. I think that the bag was a really nice gesture, however. So we're using it. I love it. And I'm trying to make sure that I put everything that needs to go to laundry, which right now is just that shirt and like the sweatpants that I'm wearing because I literally sent everything that was here today to the laundry. I also got this Yankee candle. Typically, I'll buy my candles from Marshalls, but I got this one today with the bag because I love candles and I love vanilla. So that was pretty sweet. So here we are. I'm waiting to go shower. Literally coming from outside just now where it's freaking pouring and I'm hoping that this rain does not behave like this tomorrow morning because as we know it over here I do not like to be outside when it rains. I was telling one of my residents today that the weather affects my mood. Ah. <laughs> that the weather affects my mood. Wow I should have gotten a smaller one. Anyways I'm about to go because <laughs> 